up, people? We're here to talk about the ultimate mashup, Gumps versus Tag Team. It's confirmed. We got it. Lord of the Rings universe, good and bad versus Harry Potter, good and bad. That includes any side characters, creatures, magic, whatever that universe had, they are standing up for that universe. So Voldemort is going to help Harry, the fucking king from the Lord of the Rings. We got to do our homework. He's going to be helping Gandalf and the Hobbits. Okay, we are doing our homework. Shut up! We're doing our homework with Harry Potter right now, and then we're going to be watching the Lord. Shut the fuck up! Then we're going to be doing our Lord of the Rings. So, what are your thoughts on this? Who, what team are you on? Uh, I'm still on Team Harry Potter. Harry Potter, bitch! Side with something. Boom! I did go Boom! Side. If I had the freaking editing effects, I could have go like, pff, fire explosion. Gumps on the same team, we are gonna win. Boom! Your hands all sweaty. Yeah! Okay, so you gotta get a little pumped. Get pumped! Okay, who's on whose team? It's gonna be John, Sean, and Ethan versus me, CJ, and Bryce. Okay, and I'm very confident with Bryce, thank you very much, because he did say he is proud and he is certain that Harry Potter will win. I asked him when I had, was over his house, and then he, he said, you know what, it's easy. And I'm like, really? Harry Potter? I was like really surprised. I thought he was going to say Lord of the Rings. And what was so surprising, he said, Harry Potter, easy. I was like, just, dude, I'm actually happy you're on my team now because he said easy. But John, I'm sick of Tyler going against John. I did beat him once. Let's show him that we can beat him again. I want to hear your thoughts in the comments section down below. Now, we're not going to give them any reasons, but you want to talk about this? About this match. Oh, so it's, it's the final countdown. That's what that shit is. It's the final countdown. <laughs> okay, yeah. So the Ultimate Fantasy Universes. Lord, all Lord of the Rings movies are good. All Harry Potter movies are good. Subjective, obviously. But in my opinion, all, all those movies are near flawless. So, which ones... Which is your favorite... World, like world. My favorite world. You like, mean, like, like universe, world? like that. Yeah, um, what is your favorite universe to visit? I would say um, the Hobbit, Lord of the Rings type stuff, because I like that open doors where it's less polluted and stuff. <laughs> Don't give me that look, Kyle. What the fuck? You're giving them confidence. Oh. Don't give the fucking Lord of the Rings pranks confidence just to say Harry Potter. Because you got the fucking wands. You got the freaking trolls. You got the freaking flying brooms and dragons. But you got the dragons. You got, um. What's Lord of the Rings have that we don't have? Fucking jewelry. God damn right. They have dragons, though. Yeah. Like it's, we do. Like, I mean, we, like, Harry Potter has Lord of Dragons, too. But they don't have catapults now, do they? Catapults? Yeah. They don't need catapults because they have fucking magic. Literally, that catapult becoming, that rock becoming like, oh, I'm not even going to say it because I, that's going to be for Gumps versus... But I would, I would, if I had to live in a world, if I had to live in a world, Harry Potter, because it's much more peaceful, and it's not so many, so much drama going around. Actually, not true. No, there, there's a say, there's drama, not, there is definitely drama, but there's good and bad. There's not like 12 different things you gotta worry about, like orcs, fucking elves, and then you got your humans, and then you got your hobbits, and then you got your midgets! You can't tell! And there's they got the midget color, Like, you got, like, all this shit to worry about, and you're like, the fuck? Like I said, Kyle, we already got that midget part covered. Or <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> All we're missing is those centaurs and all that other crap. Oh, they have centaurs. I Harry just, Potter. I, I know, I just said. Oh, uh, I thought you said Harry Potter didn't have centaurs. No, I knew that centaurs in the first one they did, and yeah. in the other one they did. Yeah. So, but, just are you, how confident are you with this match? Like, are you, it, was Harry Potter your very first choice to begin with, or did you have to think about it? I had to think about it, because I really like Lord of the Rings, too. But it's not movie-wise, it's who, if they, if this universe was set here, and this universe was set here, and they were forced to fight. Oh, well then, no doubt, um, Hogwarts will win because they have teachers that can put that spell that they can't go through, and then they can have those, like, 
Yeah. Stone Knights there, and they just crush them all. Yeah, we're gonna watch Harry Potter 7 Part 2, like, fucking a those, thousand times. They also have those big trolls that can just... Yeah, we're watching the whole, every single movie of the series, but we're going to watch the last ones because that's where we learn the fight. That's where we learn how they... I really like that because of the fight scene. Oh, well, fucking right. Yeah, but I still love the movie. But I'm just saying, like, the, the fight, you need to learn what their weaknesses are, and then you got to study what makes Harry Potter's world beat this world. And I'm not going to lie, I had to think about it, but for, like, a minute. Harry Potter, magic beats the sword. It's the size of a pen, and everyone knows the saying, the pen is mightier than the sword. Not true. Someone someone literally, um, oh, what was that? White House down. He's like, I choose the pen, and then he stabbed him in the neck. So that's it, guys. Which side are you on? I want to hear your thoughts. If anyone says Lord of the Rings, well, I lost faith in you as a viewer. So that's it, guys. Thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, and all that crap, and share it with your friends. Subscribe! Goodbye.